Hey guys, my name is Ethan, this is Cobra, and welcome to the series where I teach you how to build a Discord.py music bot for your server. We're back to the standard setup. We had a one video blip, but we're back with this one, so don't worry about that. In this video, I'll be showing you how to get lyrics for songs. Now, we're not only going to be um, getting the lyrics of the currently playing song, but you'll also be able to pass the song into the lyrics command to actually get the lyrics down as well. It's just going to be using a really simple uh, API request to do so. Of course, if you find the video helpful at any point, then consider liking to let me know and subscribing so you don't miss out on future videos in the series. But yeah, with that other way, let's get into it. Creating a lyrics command is perhaps not as difficult as you might expect. Um, it is basically just a simple AO HTTP request, not an API request. Uh, to a specific API endpoint, we're using the same some random API as we did in the Discord.py or in the main Discord.py series. Um, so we're going to want to import AOO HTTP, and we're also going to want to create a lyrics URL uh, or a constant defining our lyrics URL, which is going to be this. So HTTPS colon slash slash some random API dot ML, dot ML slash lyrics question mark title equals and any square brackets indicate that we're going to be putting something into here. Actually, we probably don't need that. It'd be quicker to just use standard string concatenation, to be completely honest with you. Uh, so pause the video if you want to copy that down. Uh, I'm going to... Oh, actually, we need to do an error, don't we? Yeah. So you also need an error called uh, no lyrics found, which, as you can probably tell, um, is an error which is called if no lyrics are found or if the API returns a non-200 error um, or status code for whatever reason. So we can go down to the bottom and then we can define our command. Uh, nope, that's a single space. So commands uh, dot commands uh, name equals lyrics as we did before. And then we want to do async def Lyrics command self ctx. Oh, it didn't put the command in there. Uh, and then we want to pass in name, and this is going to be a t dot optional or typing dot optional string. And the reason we're doing an optional is because we want to be able to either pass in a song name or use the name of the song that's currently playing. Uh, so if we do player equals self dot get get player. There we go. Ctx, and then we do name equals name. Or player dot q uh, dot current track dot title, and this will uh, use, as I said before, the current track title if name resolves to uh, false after a truthy check. So after we get the name and everything, the first thing we want to do is we actually want to let the user know that something is going on, and we can do this by uh, using async with ctx dot typing. Uh, the request can take a few seconds to process, and so this just lets the user know that something is happening. It's sort of like a loading um, bar or icon in a way. And after that, we actually want to make our request. So async with AIO HTTP dot request dot request, please. There we go. And then we uh, we're making a get request to our lyrics URL, which is the endpoint. And then we're passing uh, or then we're adding the name of the track to it. And then we don't need any headers. Uh, and then we're just going to take that as R. And um, we actually want to check the response was successful first, and anything that starts with the number two is. So we can do if uh, or if not two hundred uh, greater than or equal to response dot status greater than or equal to equal to two hundred ninety nine. There we go. And then we want to raise our no lyrics found uh, error because it couldn't connect to the API. And if that was successful, we want to do data equals await our or response.json. Now we actually want to check if the uh, or how long the lyrics are because sometimes you know the lyrics can be quite long. So if the len of data uh, lyrics uh, is greater than 2000 then we just want to send a link really. So we can do await ctx.send uh, and then we can do in uh, angle brackets to, to make sure the embed doesn't appear. And we can do data and then we can get links and then we can get a genius and it just kind of uh, passes out a genius link to the actual lyrics themselves. Uh, otherwise, well, I actually want to return that as well. Otherwise, we want to send an embed uh, with an in. Uh, I mean, you can just send a link if you want. If, if that's all you want, you could just, you know, do await ctx and then do that. But if you want it in an embed uh, specifically, then we can do embed equals discord.embed or embed, not ember. 
and then we can set a title equals a data title, so the the uh, the name of the track. Uh, description to be uh, data of lyrics, so the actual lyrics themselves. And then we want the color uh, to be ctx.author.color. And then we want the timestamp to be dt.datetime.utc now. Um, and we want to do embed set thumbnail uh, URL equals data thumbnail, because they do actually have a, a thumbnail, I think. I think this is the album art. Uh, that gets passed through this embed.set author uh, name equals data author and that is the the actual author of the track so the art or the artist I suppose and we want to do await uh, ctx or send embed equals embed uh, now testing this is going to be a bit weird because I'm not going to be able to play any music because obviously you know, copyright free music doesn't have lyrics. So I'm going to have to turn the volume of the bot down or I might just turn the volume of the, the thing down, uh, of the recording down. But we will still be able to get the lyrics out of it, which is good. So make sure the uh, the Lava Lake server is running and then do python launcher.py and then we'll end up with... <laughs> don't know what that voice was. And then we'll end up with uh, our bot running, of course. And then, uh, will it let us set the volume to zero if it's not in a thing? It won't even attempt it, I don't think. I think that's giving us a separate error, but we're just going to play, uh, say, Fix You by Coldplay, because I know that one actually does work. Uh, and then, yeah. I'll take the official video. And then I'll just set the volume to zero for me. Uh, and then we can get the lyrics of the current track. As you can see, this is our loading icon down here. And this is the whole the whole thing. Oh, so it's got the art of the single. That's interesting. It's not got the art of the album on. But you can see these, uh, these are the right lyrics. Everything is correct here. Of course, if you try and search up something, a name for something and it doesn't find it, then it doesn't... Oh, we didn't do the error handling. Oh no, I didn't do the hang of the plan either. Oh, that was a bit sloppy of me. Okay, back to the coding for a second. <laughs> uh, so we want to do uh, lyrics commands dot error, and then we want to do async def uh, lyrics command error self whatever whatever, and then if uh, is instance exec no uh, lyrics found, then we simply just want to send. Um, uh, no lyrics could be found, so that works. So you actually want to terminate the connection and we want to rerun it. And hopefully that will work. It's already in there, so if I just tell it to play, fix you again. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna serve and mute the bot, I think. <laughs> That's just easy in turning the volume down. And then we get the lyrics. Uh, well, we can search for lyrics. No lyrics could be found. If we get the lyrics for, um, I don't know, Clocks by Cold... I'm just apparently just using Coldplay songs because uh, it's easier to do. Okay, so this one is um, a longer one, so it's just given us a link. If we load the link, then we end up with completely the wrong... <laughs> completely the wrong song. Naturally, yeah, the for some reason the searching is not amazingly accurate. I don't know why that didn't... I have no idea. That kind of showed everything off, I think, um, that I needed to show off. <laughs> it's a bit unreliable. Maybe a different API would be better. Uh, I just wanted to use this one because it's easy to use, uh, but you can go into the Genius one and have a proper search and build like a search interface as well if you want. That would probably be quite useful, but I don't want to deal with that in this video because it's probably long enough and you could just borrow one from you know one of the other parts of the bot. Uh, but yeah, that's all I want to talk about with lyrics. Uh, if you have any questions, don't be scared to leave a comment down below, or you can join the Discord server using the link in the description. But yeah, with that, I would like to thank my Patreons that are currently on screen now. Uh, one pound a month, and you can be on this screen too. And I will see you next time, where we talk about, I don't know, probably the EQ, I would say, is coming next. I haven't really planned what order these are coming in, so it'll probably be, a, sure, it'll be the EQ, why not? <laughs> So I'll see you for that.